please press the bell icon when you subscribe. The image shows how to do it for desktop and mobile. Thank you. It's no biggie, it's just a bit of a twinge, you know, in the back. I think it happened, I did some gym and then I went out feeding the squirrels and I'm like oh. bending forward and stuff and yeah. I was like, oh. No, so something that, that can happen. Yeah, it'll be all right. And if yeah. not, I'm going to get just uh, get some stem cells and then it's all set. It's amazing. It should be all right. Yeah. No one likes a Mona. No, no. Guys with physical ailments, you know. Well, ones that whine about it. You don't want to be hanging around with someone who's whining all the time. Mm -hmm. The other bad thing for my back was um, I was sitting for a long time because I had Chinese lessons. I was I'm learning Chinese. Really? Yeah, because it's a hard uh, language. I think it's the dark souls of languages. It's, so I thought it's ridiculously it hard. Yeah. Could you say something? Uh, <laughs> Brilliant. Fabulous. Oh. Yeah. Etc. Yeah. What are you saying? Uh, a bunch of different stuff. I said, have you eaten? I said, oh. uh, something about how you look. And oh. I said, like, I speak Chinese, but not very well. And yeah, a few basic phrases. And you know what, Charlotte? I find tea to be very, very relaxing. Sometimes just the thought of drinking some tea or the sound of the spoon in the cup as it stirs is enough to relax. That's right. As you listen you might notice the eyelids start to feel heavy. They can close. It feels good. That's right. And now I want you to notice that you have strong feelings of attraction towards me. Feel them growing in your body, deep inside, as you drift down deeper. Good girl. Now, whenever I touch my cup, you'll be more and more attracted. In a second, I will wake you up as I count from one to ten, you'll slowly come back to me, feeling bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. One. Two. Three. Slowly coming back, feeling the wind. Four. Five. Six. Back to your body. Feeling more and more awake. Seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go, bright eyed and bushy tailed. Did you fall asleep there for a second? Were you daydreaming? Yeah. How do you feel? So, obviously, this is exactly the thing to do on a date. Um, if it's not going so well, or even if it is a bit of hypnosis to... Are you, can you actually hypnotise? I can. No, genuinely, can you, or... I can. <sighs> Definitely, do you believe me? No. I bet you $100 I can hypnotise you. Okay, go for it. No, let's just shake on it first. Okay. And sleep. Get off. And sleep. It obviously doesn't work, and I'm and now sleep. 100 bucks richer. Great. Oh, I didn't mean now, do it later. But it works. But you shouldn't do it as well. Obviously not hypnotising people on a date. Even if you can do it, and even if you can't do it. I no, can do it. Either war. But I won't do it.
You like big surprises? Wow. Um, Check it out. Yeah. yeah. Lottie, check out this girl there. Have you seen that? Have a look. What oh, do you think? She's, she's beautiful. Yeah, I banged her, that one. Right, okay. Yeah. She's well good in bed as well. Amazing she? chick. Well, yeah. why don't you go and... Yeah, I think I should, actually. I might come back, I might not. I, uh, I, I actually was being sarcastic. God, what a wanker. I mean... Not... Arrogance is not going to get you anywhere. Hey, Anastasia. Hey. How are you doing? You look so nice. Great dress. How's your flower shop? How's Anna? Um... How, are you still dating that guy? Um, bye, nice to see you. What what did she say? She said that you got a small dick and um, you can't sing. Not bad move. Um, not going to end well. Not going to end well there. What? So she said small dick and can't sing. Well, I'll tell you what, if I can sing really well, what would that mean? Enormous dick, probably. Wouldn't you agree? That's logical. Well, that's logical. Yeah? Go on then, give me a little... Well, not tune. right here, right now. Why not? It's a bit fun. All right, wait, I give a little it a bit go. exciting. All right. <sighs> and why don't you show like how big my dick would be based on the singing at the same time? Yeah, why not? Yeah? Okay. Alright, start there. That's about... Is that... Yeah, that's a bit small, but start I there. I think, yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. I'm not a girl. I'm not a girl. Don't show me, Don't tell me what to believe. Not yet a woman. Not yet a woman. Trying to find the woman in me. Oh. What happens? You really can't sing. Ah, oh, so she might be right. I think she is right. For fuck's sake. God. And everyone heard my singing, man. Fuck yeah, it's this. awful. Sorry, everybody. Yeah, it didn't really work, the old um, singing, but I'm going to get better. Good luck. No. What did she say? Small? Yeah, she said that you've got a small dick and that you can't see. No, 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 no. It's, it's fine. It's a normal, decent size. She just, I think she was dating this guy, like a basketballer, and maybe she had sex with a horse or something. I How don't know. big it's, is it compared to this? Uh, that's quite a big banana, to be honest. It's, it's reminiscent of that. Is it this big? Yeah, it's about that big. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Because it was okay. cold that day and all that. It's not. No, it's not the. It's not super See? small. I like your honesty. Yeah, yeah. It's all right. Mm. This one might be okay. Honest. I mean, how is that okay? Being honest. You said be but honest. It's just being a little crude on a first date. I'm just not interested. No, dicks. Talking generally. Thank you very much. Okay. So, are you single? Yeah, I'm actually currently single. And you? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Um, do you fancy meeting again? Let's definitely meet again real soon. Mm -hmm. In fact, it would be perfect if we could do it like in three days, because in four days my Pornhub subscription's up and yeah, wow. I'd have to buy another year and it's 
like, damn. Imagine like I renewed it and then I started getting laid and I didn't really use it. It'd be mm -hmm. a waste of money, yeah? Yeah, it would. Yeah, so maybe in like three days? Come round. Maybe. Round. I might have something Little. better actually for you. Doubt it, but let's see what you got. What's this? Little love letter. <laughs> you could call it that. And what is it? Wow, girls. That's Log my subscription. Is that your login? Yeah. Oh, thank you. I don't know what to say. That's amazing. It's OK. Do you mind? I'm, I'm going to go now. I have a wank right. right now. Yeah. Thank you. Um, he says if she doesn't have sex, he's going to need to renew his uh, porn subscription. Oh, I mean, this is just disgusting. I don't want to hear this. We're 100% going to meet again because if we don't, I'm going to kill myself. So you have to meet me. <laughs> Could I come and watch? I love people who kill themselves. Could I bring a friend? You're psycho. I love death. Oh. What were you thinking, man? Obviously that's wrong. Yeah, of course, I can meet any time, really. I'm pretty agenda fluid when it comes to it. Okay. <laughs> you like this one? Like if you've got a kind of flexible schedule, you can say you're a gender fluid. No, I don't get it. Don't get it? No. Is it supposed to be funny? Oh, it wasn't funny, I'm afraid. I just get the check, actually. Thanks. So what's your plans for the coming week? You busy? Um, well, I have a spa treatment. Oh hey, um, yeah? Just one? Yeah, well, tomorrow. Yeah. Excellent. I have them, like, once a week. Um, I've got to get my nails redone. Uh, I've got a shopping trip actually with my mother. Oh, that's all so. nice stuff. Nothing. Yeah. Uh... Oh, I've got a Pilates class as well. Excellent. So, so nice. nothing strenuous or hazardous. Or... Well, the Pilates can be quite strenuous. That's actually. true, actually. Yeah, yeah. could be. Hey, let's do something a little bit interesting. Why don't we play a game and thank you. Whoever wins, uh, yeah, if you win, I'll pay. And if I win, you pay, all right? Hmm. It's called Five Lies, really easy. Okay. You just need to lie five times. Do you think you could do that? Well, I could lie, yeah. Yeah, all right. Okay, okay we're gonna start, right? So that, number one, I'm gonna ask you a question. What color is your shirt? Pink. Ah, see, that's it. Exactly, that's what you need to do. Okay. Uh, what is, what is, what is, what's the country in the Mediterranean? South Africa. Oh, see, you got it. That's very good. <laughs> All right, doing well so far. I'm going to try and catch you out. So, um, what's the name of the last president of the United States? I'm about to lie. Oh, well, I um, mean, if you want to win. If I, oh yeah. Oh, sorry. Um, let's say Gordon Brown. And good one, good one. <laughs> All right, hang on a minute. So you needed to lie five times. How many questions was that? I've done three. <laughs> Got ya. You see? <sighs> okay, yeah, cool game. Yeah, see, you lost. So, but let's okay. imagine you got it right. So if I said, how many was that? Three. But that's the... Oh, five. You, exactly. Oh, have you played this before? And you say no, and get you on the last one. Right. So that's how it works. Okay. Cool, yeah? All right, so thank you. Luckily, I didn't order any Cristal or lobster, so it should be all right.
Nice one. Uh, Five Lies is a pretty cool game. You could play it in this scenario. Uh, you could play it almost at any time in an interaction, on a date. Uh, it's just pretty fun, so you can always try it. Yeah, fun, lighten up the mood. Always a good one. So listen, we could meet on like, I don't know, Wednesday or something, but do you have any other slutty friends for other days of the week? Because I like to have just a lot of sluts. I'm so sorry. Why? Why? I'm the sluttiest of all my friends. Oh my god, that is brilliant. And even with me, you won't get a second date. What do you mean? You're not going to meet me again? Absolutely not. Oh, but you're slutty. It's my dream. Yeah, I'm the biggest slut you'll find, but you're not going to have me in bed. Oh, you're just teasing me now. Mm-hmm. But I might just go back and think about what you just said and touch myself. Yeah. So at least I got that much. Delightful. Oh, Is this sexist? Yeah, insulting. I thought so. So we should definitely meet again soon. Why don't I give you my phone and just unlock it? And you can just put your number in there and I'll be in touch. Great, that's the right option. Uh, setting up the second date, all good. Um, yeah, what was I saying? Uh, you were just going to put your number in. Yeah, of course. You want to meet again? Yes, of course I want to meet you. Yeah. You're so lovely. Here we go. That's right. I think um, you're probably the nicest guy I've been on a date with in a long time. Mm, and this, there's more to come. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, because you've hypnotised her? Yeah, because um, what you do is, during the hypnosis, you establish an anchor, which is either a touch or an action or something, and then when you do that again later, it re-triggers the hypnotic state and she slips right back into the trance. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's the technical aspect of it. But... But morally... Morally... Don't hypnotise your dates. Slightly worrying if you do. Yeah, but you could hypnotise someone to help them quit smoking with their consent or... Yeah, that's the whole point. You need consent. You can't just hypnotise any old person. Yeah. <laughs>